Hey cute people. Mm -hmm. This is the last haul for 2019 for sure. And this is going to be my last haul for a long time. Now I told you in 2020 I'm going to be on a no buy. But I can't say it's going to be a no buy for the whole year. Remember now, there's three things that I'm going to purchase if they go on sale. And they don't count towards the no buy. So it's really going to be a low, low, no buy. Because it's going to be really, really low. And if I purchase anything from Dollar Tree, you know, beauty supplies or just some of their little beauty knickknacks, that doesn't count. I'm talking about <laughs> spending major money. Major money. But anyway, I got some stuff from Miss A. And let me tell you something. This particular site here, I could have stayed on it forever. But I said, you know what? Let me get my stuff and get off of here because a lot of things I wanted was no longer available. Well, not out of stock, out of stock. So I got my bag and I see they send pink bags and green bags. But I got a cute little old pink bag. I opened everything up. It's here. Feel good. So I opened up everything and I just dumped everything in the bag because I got all that stuff that they pack it with and all that other stuff and I think I always saw people get pink paper but someone mentioned they had purple paper and here it is I have purple paper myself so I know I will purchase other things from Miss A I don't know when I um I'm not even sure it's going to be really soon but it, it, it will be now like I mentioned I got a few things so this was their Cyber Monday sale and everything was 25% off and even though a lot of things were a dollar, you can't be 25% off of a dollar. What's that, 75 cents? So you just got to go ahead and do what you got to do. And I did what I had to do, y'all. So I'm going to just pull stuff out of the bag in no order at all. But some things I'm going to try on because I'm just curious to know how it feels, looks, and how it works with my skin and complexion. But one thing I did get was the primer spray and setting spray. This was a set. And as you can see, each cost $1.88. It was on a special. I can't remember the price. I wish I had something here um, that would indicate how much I paid for it, which I believe if I went online, I could. But they do give you um, a little invoice of what you ordered, and here's the stuff that I ordered. But it doesn't give you the prices, just what you ordered and the quantity. So again, this was um, a set, and you can purchase it by yourself. So you don't have to purchase it together, but purchasing it together at that time, it was a great deal. So I got the full set. And as you can see, it's a primer and... Um, a setting spray. So let's just see. Oh, I thought it was plastic. What did I? You know, funny thing. I thought plastic was on top of this. It's not a plastic thing here. It had two pieces of tape. I cut it, and I'm filling the plastic off. There's no plastic. But anyway, I'm gonna leave it like this. Okay. So this is the primer spray. Let's take a look here. Now I have quite a few things. I'm gonna run through this really quick because I want to share a lot with you guys. Now here's the plastic. <laughs> So then you say, why didn't you open this stuff up before you did the video? Because I didn't feel like it. You know how things are when you're in a hurry. You do everything at the last minute. Okay, but in the meantime of me opening up, opening up things, I can talk to you guys. Because, you know, I have a lot to say. So this is the primer spray for smooth, even skin. So here's what it looks like. Right? Let's see what it smells like. It really doesn't have a smell. A, a slight little smell, which makes me think of fruit. Okay, so here's the spray. I'm just going to put a little on my face. Mmm. It can't help but feel good, right? Yeah, there's a little scent. Mmm. But the scent is not overwhelming at all. So if you're not one who likes scents, don't worry. This will not bother you at all. And here's the setting spray. It says it locks in makeup. Okay. And let's see what this smells like. I won't spray this on my face. But I just want to see what it smells like. So I can tell you guys what it smells like. And I didn't wear makeup today because, like I mentioned, there's some things I want to try. Mmm. Okay, it smells kind of fruity to me. I don't know if you've ever smelled this. Leave in the comment section below what it smells like to you. But it doesn't smell bad, like I mentioned. Um, yeah, it doesn't smell bad at all. Okay, let's see what the next thing is that I pulled out of my bag here. Now, I did get some lashes. Why? I don't know. 
what can I tell you? I have another thing of lashes. Where's the other one? If I'm going to show you all the lashes at the same time. I think I only got three. Yes. I got the AOA Studio. These are supposed to be natural length is what I was looking for. But it says natural hair. Yeah, right. These are Rita. And like I mentioned, I was looking for lashes that had a natural length because I really don't want to wear anything too dramatic for myself during the day. And these are Mila. And that's AOA Studio. And this here is Cara Beauty. It says 100% human hair. And this is number 606. I was really just trying to get all things AOA Studio, but I guess I got these here. And, and when it comes to makeup, yes, I was trying to get all AOA Studio, but um, I think I got some other things also. I got a little thing of Zuri Cocoa Butter Soap. I mean, it's little. Look how little. Look how little. A dollar. I thought it was going to be a full-size bar, but it's not bad. I love socks. Oh, I got a pair of pads here. Yes, a dollar. These came in so many different um, colors, and a lot of them were sold out. And I guess they would because they were so cute. They had a lot of pretty um, light, bright colors. But again, they were sold out. Okay, so this is another thing I got. I got the Moochie Wonder Blender. And I'm sure by now a lot of people already are familiar with AOA Studios and how they donate money to different causes. This here, the AOA Sponge, right? $1.88 the usual price. And I believe it's over a dollar because... The 88 cent they donate to. Let's see who they tell us they donate this to. This here goes to supporting kids' education. And I believe these sprays also go to kids' education, I believe. Yeah. Well, here it says, you know, fragrance-free. This is, says fragrance-free. This one also says paraben-free, absorbs alcohol, and minimizes your pores. Did I tell y'all all that? No, I didn't. Because like I said, I have a lot to show you. So I want to move through kind of quickly. So forgive me for not giving you some of the important points of some of the things you may need to know. But this is the Wonder Blender. Here it is. And it's really soft. And I have, I don't know if you can tell. Yeah, there it is. Okay, I have the blunt side there. And it's round. But they have different um, blenders that you can choose from. And they're all, I guess, I don't know if they're all a dollar eighty-eight. As you can see, this is a dollar eighty-eight, so I'm not really sure, but it looks like it's going to feel pretty decent. And then I got this hand cream here, Miss A. Well, they put it in a little bag, and my order came out to like thirty-five dollars, I believe. But then with the twenty-five percent off, it came down to like twenty some odd. I wish I had the um, invoice so I can tell you guys, but. I did pretty good. I ain't gonna complain. Now this here lotion, hand lotion, it came in different um, scents, but I picked natural coconut oil. Mm. Here's the hand cream. It's a nice size too for a dollar. And this is the one I wanted to try. I wanted to try all of them, but I figured let me try one first because sometimes you get hand creams and they ain't worth the money that you spend on them. So let's see. I took the little. Is that another one on here? I took the tab off, and then there's something else. Oh gosh, just, then there's something else here to take off that didn't come off. Why not? Okay, I ain't gonna fool with it too long because I gotta keep moving. They have another piece of plastic on here. After I already took the silver piece off, but oh, there it is. Okay, I got it out a little bit, but here, okay, it's pretty thick. All right, let's see what it feels like. Very light scent, but it does smell like coconut, but it's very light. So if you are wanting to try this one at least, you don't have to worry about And if I remember, I'm going to let you know how my hands look at the end of the video, especially this part here where it gets pretty, but, but it feels good. Not greasy, mm -hmm, but definitely moisturizing. All right, let's move on. And then the next thing I picked up, I wanted some of their blender holders, but a lot of them were sold out, especially the pretty ones, the rose gold one, gold one, and all that. Those things were sold out, but I got this one here. 
AOA Studio, AOA Studio is a blender holder. And it comes in different colors, but for whatever reason, I, well, I picked black. And I picked black because I figured if you're putting your blender in it, you don't want it to be nasty and dirty. So I picked the black one. And with the blender, it would look like this. Let's see. I want some more because these are really great to have. Okay, so like I said, it looks something like that. Right? Not bad, right? Okay. So the next thing I picked up, let's see. I picked up some glue. I'm not really big on... I know I picked up two. I think I picked up two. I'm not really big on lashes, but I know certain looks really look nice with lashes. So since I have some lashes and I have a lot more lashes, which I thought I had another one of these. I thought I picked up black and clear, but I have the clear. The black, the black, the black, the black. Which I thought I had clear too, but I picked this up here. You see it's $1.88, so that lets you know that it's going to go... Well, some of the money is going to go to... Kids education, I think. This one goes to kids education. Because some of it goes to... Okay, yeah, this one goes to kids education. Some of the things I know um, would go to... Okay, maybe I am. Okay, so then the next thing I picked up... I did pick up um, an LA Colors... I don't know why. Because I could get this from... Well, I don't know. I picked up the LA Colors Auto Eyeliner in black. And I don't know why I picked this up. When I first saw it, I thought maybe they sent me something extra, but it was on my list. And like I said, I don't know why I would get that because I have enough eyeliners over here. And right here. I picked this up. I got this too. Um, and they put it in a little thing here, so that's good. See how my hands are so moisturized, but not greasy, not greasy. Well, anyway, I picked this up, and this is the Perfect Pressed Highlighter. I picked that up. Oh, goodness. Everything is locked up, which is good, but I got to open it up. Okay, and here it is. This is really pretty. Tell me that it isn't. Look how pretty that is. Ooh, let's see. Boom, 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 boom. Maybe here. Okay, I think that's more like it. Yeah. That's more like it. Away from the light. Isn't that pretty? Ooh, it's so off. Mm, I'm not sure how me like gold. I probably have to. Let me see. Okay. Mm, I can get with that. All right. And this color here is Gilded. AOA Studios Gilded. And I also picked up a blush. My goal was trying to pick up enough stuff to do a full face, but I didn't because um, I didn't get any eyeshadow for sure because what I wanted was sold out. So I just got a few things that I will be using. And this is the AOA Perfect Blush. And I like this color. And when I saw it, I was like, okay, it's definitely different. Is, and I'm going to just tap into it a little lightly. Okay, now I did it very lightly because of the brightness you can see. And it does definitely show up for sure. Okay, I can get with this. I know they had other shades. I can't say that I liked any other ones or wanted to try them, but this one here is called Kindle. So I got that. I also picked up some foundations. Now the thing with their foundations, the shades that I thought were close to my complexion were all sold out. All sold out. So I picked a lighter one and a darker one, hoping that it would look pretty decent when I mix them. These were $1.88, so I won't be too upset if um, it's a miss, but I'm hoping that it won't be only because we don't buy makeup for it to be a miss, right? We want it to work. So these are the colors that I picked up. Let's see here. This is rich, which as you can see is very dark. 
and this is amber which you can see is very light so oh i guess my hands being greasy is not easy to loosen okay i finally got it okay one thing i like about it it has a little dropper let's see okay it's really dark so what i'm going to do i'm just going to put a little on my hand not a lot just a little bit and then i'm going to take rich now i've seen people put this on their face it always seemed like it was so loose but it's not um as liquidy as i thought it would be then i'm going to take a little bit of amber i don't have a brush here but that's okay because what i'm going to do is just use my fingers to mix it together and see what it looks like for me i may have to play with the formula as far as which one would need more of a color or less of a shade, I should say. But that's what it looks like. Okay, so let's see what it looks like on my face. Feels pretty good. Feels pretty decent. And that's what it comes out to look like, which I don't think... Hmm... Okay, let me get a brush and just buff this into my face and see what it'll look like. Okay, so I'm back and I have my Sonia Kush, Kushik, Sonia Kushik brush, Kushik, 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 that I just hauled the other day. So let's see what this will come out to look like. I think that if I mess around with the formula, maybe I need to hmm, play around with it a little, a little bit more to see... Because, like I said, I don't want to order any more. I want to stay true to my not buying anything. It's a little it's a little too dark, as you can see. So let me put a little bit more of this lighter color on my face and see how that comes out. Because I just want to... Let's see. But as far as how it looks and feels, it feels pretty decent. So when I mix it, I can tell I just need to put a little bit more of the lighter color in. Okay, yeah. I need to do a better job of mixing. I think I could make it work, like I mentioned, if I just mess around with it a little bit. Mm. But it, overall, it feels good. It doesn't feel bad at all, so mm, we'll see. And so, I went on and continued purchasing stuff, and I got these here. AOA Studio Natural Finish Medium to Full Coverage. Um, they call it their Non-Drying Creamy Long Wearing Foundation. So, I got two of these, and I got one... Um, let's see. Amber again and nutmeg. Nutmeg and amber. So let's see what these are about here. And again, as you can see, if you didn't notice, I'll put it up again. But these cost a dollar fifty-five cents. So you know they're taking some of the funds and donating it. But they're donating this to Paw Paw. So I guess the little animals get this one. Let's see. Mm. Part of the proceeds support animals in need. I think that's really, really nice that they do this with their products because the price being as reasonable, as low as it is, I mean, that's, which one is this one here? This one is amber. So let's see. I'm going to use this foundation brush just to see what it looks like. Okay. So I'm just using this foundation brush to see what it looks like. Okay. It's a little bit lighter than what I would like for my foundation but that's okay so what I'm oh you know what I'm gonna do let me try this here let's see I have a little bit on my wrist so I'm gonna see what happens when I try to put a little bit under my eye so I definitely could use this maybe as a highlighter I'm not sure if it's all I get. But one thing I can say, I'm just glad these things just cost a dollar and some change because I think 
colors that I'm not really sure will work with me. But I think I can work with that a little bit. But then I got this one here, which is a little bit darker. And this one is nutmeg. So let's see what this looks like. I'm going to have a crazy thumbnail for this video because I'm definitely... Oh, did I show you the tube? Okay, that's the tube. You get quite a bit for a dollar or 55 cent. Okay, now here's... That's what nutmeg looks like. So this looks like I may be able to... I'm just dropping everything. This looks like I may be able to use it um, to conceal spots. Let's see. What do I have under my fingernails? A whole bunch of junk. Let's see. This is... I don't know. I have foundation or something under my nails. Excuse that. But um, yeah, let's see. Now this, as you can see, is really creamy. I'm going to put some on my face. This might be one. Yeah, I'm going to put it over here. Mm, I don't know. Mm, maybe I would use this as a highlight, maybe. Just to give me a little highlight. Let's see. I can't really see. Oh, yeah. I think I would use this as a highlight. The other one, I'm not sure what I've used that one for. Maybe if I mixed it a little. I know. Okay. Mm. All right. Now, I'm going to go back and put some of this on my face again. Ooh. I just wanted to see what this would look like. This is a pretty, um, the blush. Okay. All right. So that's what that looks like. I have some experimenting to do if I decide to experiment. I really don't care to, but I have the stuff. I got to make it work, right? I thought I had two. Hmm. I thought I bought two lash glues. And then I was like, why did I buy two lash glues? Let's see. Socks. Da -da 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 lash glue. No, I only bought one. Okay, I bought black, which is cool. And then I have some stuff in this bag here. This video is longer than I wanted it to be. But that always happens, right? Okay, so in this bag here, there is um, what is this? The AOA eyeshadow primer. Okay, now I can't really test it out this moment i'm gonna put it on my eye though just so you can see what it looks like but i didn't get an eyeshadow and i didn't even realize they sell singles i think i saw someone hold some single shadows on the well on their video but anyway this is the eyeshadow primer aol perfect okay so i guess all their things are called perfect little wand here let's see Let me out to tell y'all what color this is too, because it's really, really light. That's all I'm gonna do. So you can see it here. Because I told you guys the video is gonna be long. I'm not using my computer, so I can't do a lot of fast forwarding and cutting and stuff like that. So I try to keep it short, but it doesn't look like it's going to be short. Is this a color here? Okay, let's see. Eyeshadow primer. Eyeshadow primer. Okay, they call this glow. I guess so, because you can see how light it is. All right, I can get with that, not a problem. And then I got three glitters. Why, I don't know. I just wanted to try glitters, but I want to try them for occasions, of course. And they're all from AOA. AOA. Okay, and I got this color here, which is, let's see. Here's the, the, I'll try to read the color for you. Let me do it back some. Let's see. It's really like um, a peach. Yeah, that looks like it. There it is. Okay. Let me tell you what the color is in case you are interested. Now I'm going to have glitter everywhere. This color here is, 
light peach, just that, light peach. And then I have this one here. Like I said, I bought them because I think they are gorgeous when I see young women put this stuff on their eyes. And I was like, they would say for older women, we should stay away from stuff like this, but I don't believe in that. And this right here is really, really pretty. Look at that. Look how pretty that is. Really pretty. Let me tell you what color this one is. And they were only, what, a dollar. So I got it from 75 cents, really. This one is gold. I would have purchased more, but I don't think I'll be wearing these often. I will definitely be using them, but not an awful lot. And then this one here I have is called Tanzanite. And this one is really, really pretty. And here's Tanzanite. iridescent flakes really gorgeous and like I said they had other ones but these are the ones that I really wanted so I just got these okay I got some more stuff to show you I know I know I know oh. and then for whatever reason I picked up this this is a um, sculpting stick a contour stick I don't know why I got this um, I guess when things are a dollar and then they are on sale for 25% off you just Put all kinds of stuff in your cart. And you're like, do I really need it? And you're like, yeah, I do. I got this one here. Okay, now this color here is clay clay. That's the color. Yeah, okay, look. You get a lot for 99 for a dollar. Well, 75 cents. Really, really. Too bad I'm on a no buy because I sure would like to purchase some more of this stuff. It's not my, oh, it's not my color at all. Nope. It doesn't look, not look good. Mm. That's why I don't like to purchase makeup online. But now if I decide to purchase another stick, I know not to get this one. This is clay. Maybe I should have looked, listened for the name. Clay would sound kind of like. And then I got this, which I'll show you first. I got this um, Wonder Liner, AOA Studios. It's just a lip liner here. Let's see how creamy it is, if it's creamy at all. Oh, gosh. Now, I hope you guys stay for the whole video because, you know, you need to see everything I got. And this color here is, mm, what's the color? Tease, okay, here's Tease. I don't know if you can see it at all. Okay, that's Tease, let's see how it looks. Okay, okay, it's creamy now. I'm just gonna put a little bit on it, see ya. And the one thing I noticed that their um, eyeliners all match with what I'm going to show you next, which is their Wonder Matte um, the Liquid Lipsticks. This is also in the color Tease, so that's the name of it. And it's pretty much a matching set. And I would have gotten a lot more of these, but I wasn't sure how I would like it, so I figured I'd get one. But as you can see, there's Tease, the lip liner. And I'm going to show you. Okay, I don't like this color for me. And then this is Tease, the matte lipstick. So I'm going to put it on. Okay, now one thing I'll say about it, I think that once I put on a lip liner, it's going to look much better. Why is that like that on the side of my mouth? Me don't like how that look over down the side of my mouth, so let me wipe it off. Okay, as you can see, this is not my color by itself, but hey. Okay, so this I had to get because I like the packaging. 
This is Starry Mascara. And look at the packaging. Look, isn't that cute? Sexy. <laughs> it's so cute. I had to get it. Can you really see? Yeah. There it is. Let's see what the wand looks like. Mm, okay. I don't have any eyelashes. Now, one thing I can tell you so far, just putting it on, is not clumpy, which I like. Now, I don't know how it would be if I start building it up, but right now, I don't know if you can see, it's not clumpy at all, which is cool, which is cool. I like that. And let me see if it tells you what color I got. So, I'm back. Okay, so as you can see, Starry Mascara, here it is, and I got the color black. And like I mentioned, I do like it because it's so light. Oh, okay. I'll check that out really soon. And then I picked up this gold brow in the color dark brown. It's really small. And here is the little wand. And then let's see what it looks like on my brows here. Okay, I don't know if I feel anything coming out. Let's see. Uh, I'm not sure. I guess it's going to work. Okay, so I ran some across my hand here, and this is what it comes out to look like. It was really kind of dry. As let me show you here. So I'm not sure. I guess it's going to work. Um, let's see. Oh, a little does come out. Maybe it's just supposed to be a little because a little does come out. You can see there. This will really be fantastic for someone who has some brows unlike myself. But, I, okay, I think I could do a little something with this here. Let's see. Okay, maybe for natural, not wearing any makeup type day. Or after I do something with my brows, just run that through the hair. And then I picked up another brow pencil. Okay, I wish I would have picked this up first before I showed you the brow, gold brow. But let's see, let me get this open. And I mentioned before that, or did I? Yeah, I'm pretty much just wanting to get brow pencils, go back to brow pencils because me and my eyebrows, we go through it I tell you so I figured I just get a brow pencil and then use the brow pencil to do something with my non-existent brows but I'm gonna say this while I'm opening this package up and that is that I really do hope you guys subscribe to the channel only because I have fun here and I hope okay it cut off again, so I can't stay long. But this is the pencil I wanted to show it to you, right? And really quickly, this pencil here is in the color. I should have looked at it before I started the video or recording, right? Come on now, where's the pencil? It's in dark brown, okay. So I showed you what it looked like. Boom, spool you on the end. Ba -ba -ba -ba. And this side here, here is the pencil see and I got it in dark brown. oh it looks kind of light for dark brown let's see what it looks like and I believe this was the next to darkest color after yeah I need I want a darker color I don't want this color here but let's see what it does okay hmm I'm not sure about the color, but it's really waxy. Well, I shouldn't say waxy, but it, it goes on smooth. And you can see, I don't have to do much to get a little payoff. So that's not bad. Mmm, okay. All right, so that's what it looks like. And here it is, Swatch. This is dark brown. Wait a minute, hold on now. But this is... I gotta look at that again because I don't think there was a this is not dark enough for me can you see it I would like it to be a little bit darker but I still would go ahead and use it and this is dark brown hmm. nice feel 
packaging. And that's what I purchased from Shop Miss A. So now I'm a Missy. And um, like I mentioned, I don't know if and when I'm going to purchase from them again. Because I'm on a no buy, so I'm not supposed to be purchasing a lot of stuff. I know I wouldn't mind getting some more of their socks. Checking into their little earrings to see if I see anything that I like. Um, I don't know. But maybe I'll just stay off the site because then I'll be tempted to buy especially some more of their glitters. Some more of their um, foundation. Especially if I can find my color. I don't know what I did right here. But listen. I'm going to end this video now because I need to clean up my face and stuff. And change my clothes and all that. Because I have to work this evening not that long just a little while and i want to come back home and then just be able to relax and stuff like this i gotta clean up all this mess i made here but i did mention to you about subscribing if i hadn't i mentioned it again so you may as well go ahead and subscribe for more me i do appreciate your stopping by appreciating you stopping by to watch the video hopefully you stay through the whole video so that you can hear me say share and spread love Yes, I'm running. I got to go. Thank you for watching. Ooh, this lip color ain't me. But I'm taking a picture with my makeup just like this. Yep. Mm -hmm. Just like this. Watch.